I always wanted to be somebody like an independent artist who writes songs in his bedroom on Kodish in the middle of the forest. The music is for me something really important. It helped me get through that hard time in my life that is quarantine. I am also a singer, an amateur singer with a little bit of experience. If you're an artistic soul, I think you could relate to some of the things I will present. If you're, if you're interested in how am I my own teacher, please hear me out. When it comes to performing on stage, when I was younger, I was stressed every time. But now, when I'm older, it comes more naturally and I'm not as stressed as I was a few years ago. That was about singing. But what if I have to make a speech in front of the people, like just right now? I am completely freaking out. Like, really, my voice is changing. I'm not speaking like this in every conversation. I'm going around the whole of the room just because I can handle that pressure. I actually did all the things just now. But okay, we're a little bit of the topic. Songs. When I, I have to choose a song for the performance, I always have a giant problem. Especially when the theme is open and there is no categories on songs that participants should follow. From my personal experience, when you have an open theme, you should find out based on what you are rated for. In my past, it was usually Arctic or Polish songs. So in May, 2021, I participated in Youth Art Festival. I had to choose two songs, sing one first and the second was on the judges requested. I was asked to sing all songs and on the competitions like that is often a good thing because either they want to listen to you because you sing beautifully or you have the potential to win something. So a few hours later, I found out that I went to the next stage or on the third place. Remember my advice, always choose a song that suits you the most, but remember you will have a higher chance to win something if you will know something about your jury. When I'm preparing my singing performance, I never sing a song more than three times per hour, because especially when I chose a song with high sounds, my voice is just tired after singing the same lines over and over again and it just sounds bad. The day before the performance, I had this belief that the last version of a song has to be perfect or else I will do a terrible job the next day. Just before coming on stage, I always take three breaths because it makes me feel focused and calm. When I'm there, I feel like a fish in the water. I feel like this is my place and this is where I belong. We all had online classes, didn't you know we? I bought myself a ukulele, so I had plenty of time to write and learn how to play on that thing. Don't ask me to play something and I know for chords. During the week, I stayed up long because mostly at nights I had a creative inspiration. I just sat on my bed, listening to music and writing my own lyrics. Honestly, not long, but real. Writing was also my stepping stone from that hopeless reality that we all had to face. This loneliness and anger that accomplished me then, I just put it on paper. But now, when I look at it, I realize that it helped me get through that period of time. Going back to the singing theme, to be honest, I am always more stressed about performing in front of the family or friends than the strangers. This is just something I can handle sometimes. In my past, I used to refuse to sing on the family events just because I was stressed. I had a lot more to tell you about my little experience, but unfortunately, we don't have time for that. I think I said my part, and now it's up to you whether you take it personally or not. I hope I didn't bore you. If so, maybe I will wake you up when I sing a song. Oh, 
Else. 